What is up my beautiful Marmars and welcome back to my kitchen today You guys have requested it and today I'm finally doing it We're doing the DIY giant s'mores First you're gonna need some butter Lots of butter Just throw all this butter straight into the machine Okay not like that Marley You're gonna slowly put the butter in like this Start churning it We need to cream the butter and some other ingredients together right now But just keep putting as much butter as you can As you can see the butter is gonna start attaching to the hook You wanna put in these two cups of brown sugar Dark brown sugar Brown sugar in general works It started to get really sticky so we started to just jab at them You know double teamed it Here we go brown sugar Now we're mixing it and it's getting better and better you want to get some dark corn syrup and just pour it in gently like this yes yes graham crackers man I didn't know this is how it was made but now that you have creamed everything in this pot it's time to mix your dry ingredients you got some baking soda and flour there's the flour okay just mix that into the butter and all the other stuff add a little bit of water mix it all together and then you want to work in all the flour eventually into this once you do that it's gonna be this awesome doughy consistency like look at this right here Wow look at it just use your hands now it's the point where you just got to make sure the flour really gets incorporated to your graham cracker you just want to keep moving around eventually you can just get it into a nice ball like this and set it on your table get all the nice graham cracker out of there and just knead it just play with it have a great time and make sure to just mix it all up and massage the graham cracker all around like this move it all around into a nice little ball and then you want to wrap it up and get ready to let it rest for about 30 minutes because you know graham crackers gotta rest yeah anyways it's been 30 minutes now I took the graham cracker out and I'm gonna just lay it here cut it right in half oh yeah ooh Ooh, look at that and I'm gonna use this pan as a guider to make my giant graham cracker so I'm gonna just use this thing to measure it's gonna be 10 by 10 and I'm just gonna poke these little holes so they look like graham crackers yes yep these aren't even baked yet I'm so excited to get them in the oven right now we have preheated it to 375 degrees let's put them in there ah yes come on my little graham crackers get in here and rest and grow <laughs> it's been 15 minutes now Ooh. Look at our graham cracker! Oh my gosh, it is massive. Holy cow. Oh my goodness, this is so hot. Oh. Time to make the marshmallow fluffiness. We gotta add some sugar, and then we wanna add some salt. And then we're gonna add some corn syrup. Lots of corn syrup, tons of corn syrup. Like so much corn syrup, you get like, Ugh! Ugh! more corn syrup. Yes, corn syrup and water. That's the boring one, but it's okay, you know. You, someone's gonna be the water. We're gonna mix it all together, mix it all nice, and then heat it up, and then it's gonna be white, and then it's gonna boil. And we're adding water and some gelatin to make what's called a gelatin balloon, which is, that's what makes the marshmallow fluffy. It adheres to the corn syrup, gets like big and fluffy. We're gonna do that in a second, but we first wanna mix these in together. Get this nice and emulsified. <laughs> so now that our water and gelatin are mixed together, this is gonna be one of eight times we're doing this to make a giant marshmallow. We have one cup of our corn syrup mixture. I'm just gonna pour it down the edge. And it's gonna slowly mix together. I'm gonna speed this up eventually. We're gonna have it whipping so fast that it's gonna turn into a marshmallow. And I'm gonna do this eight different times. And so I'm just gonna speed this up and show me pouring the marshmallow into the giant pan. So you guys don't have to watch me do this eight times. <laughs> oh yeah, look how fluffy that is. This is the first of eight times I'm doing it probably, but I'm not gonna show you every single time I'm doing it. I'm just gonna show you like maybe number five and six and two apparently i'm showing you number two right here oh yeah okay we're jumping to like the end one. Oh, look at that trust me this took hours but i'm only showing you parts of it you're welcome giant marshmallows take a really long time to make but i do it because i love you guys so big thumbs up for me all right guys it has been a whole day now i have my giant marshmallow right here hopefully it came out perfect for a giant s'mores um oh i feel like something's coming i feel like something Something coming? Oh, oh. Uh, uh, it's gonna. Uh, oh! Yeah! Look at this giant marshmallow! Oh, hello, darling. You're so beautiful. Let me get you all nice and dusted so you're not sticky. Wow, this thing is so amazing and humongous, and it's the perfect marshmallow for my giant s'mores. Look! Uh, 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 I just want to take a bite. 
Okay, I can't. I can't. I gotta control myself because we gotta make a giant s'more with this. Uh, all right, so now I'm gonna prep my giant graham crackers. As you can see, they're a little bit off because, you know, the baking process. I grab the first one and I put it on top of the second one and now I'm gonna just make sure they're even and I'm just gonna start to cut. So I have a giant graham cracker piece right here. I forget. The giant chocolate bar, oh my gosh. Look how big this thing is. Look it, here's my giant marshmallow, here's my head, here's the chocolate bar. Let's open this bad boy up. Gosh, oh my goodness. So much chocolate. Look at, oh my gosh, pure chocolate. Ooh, <laughs> wow. If you're not from America, this is an American delight called the s'more. So you get a graham cracker, you get a big piece of chocolate, you get a giant marshmallow right here, set it right on top like that. And you know, sometimes you have a little extra chocolate. You go ahead and just throw that right on there. Bam. And then you get your other graham cracker crust and just bam. <laughs> what? Look at our s'more. This is a giant s'more. The chocolate's right here. Oh my goodness. I might make the chocolate stick out a little bit more for aesthetic reasons. This thing is huge. Okay, I'm gonna attempt to lift it up. I might break this paddle, guys. We only might get one chance at lifting this thing up. Okay, here we go. It's so heavy! Oh! So I moved the big piece of chocolate to the bottom because I thought it would just look so much cooler to have the chocolate combined. A lot of chocolate is more fun. Look at this s'more though. Oh my gosh, I can't wait to eat you. But Marlon, how can you even call this a s'more if it's not even toasted? I can fix that. <laughs> Let's do a taste test. This looks so delicious. Like, oh, look at that. Okay, here we go. My first bite into my own giant s'more. In three, in two, in one. Oh, it's so good. Ah, ah, mm, 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 mm. I'm gonna get so much diabetes from this. This is so good. Oh my God, God. This giant s'more is life. We can take a piece of the cookie and just like, uh, Oh, mmm. Look at that. Oh, it's so creamy. But look at that. Mm. It's so delicious, guys. I break out a piece of chocolate. Oh, you know, a little piece right there. Mmm. I can eat this. This is so good. I love that. If you're gonna invite all your friends over, all your friends come and eat your giant s'mores at your giant s'mores party with you. I wish I could fit all this in my mouth. Ah, so I can take one big giant bite for you guys, but it's like. It's really impossible. It's like so hard to do, but I, I'm telling you guys right now, this is the perfect winter treat, summer treat, spring treat. Every treat is like just so delicious and it's crispy. And it's, uh, mm, I love it. Ah, thank you guys so much for watching me make a giant s'more today. I had so much fun. Like, if you guys make this recipe, please tweet me or Snapchat me your giant s'mores. I want to see them. I am the king of giant marshmallows. I've made the most giant marshmallows on the internet. I want to see them. Send them to me. I would like to see them. I will see you guys tomorrow. Please give this video a big thumbs up. It took me a really long time to make this giant s'more. It's getting really heavy. I'll see you guys tomorrow at 12 p.m. for another new video. Peace! Oh! <laughs>